Oh, I almost forgot. Here's the quick bonus. You can use Ad Compa Reader to test your website. Why would you want to do that? Well, you can actually use Taguchi on your website and not just your AdWords ad. So just like you could define as many elements and options on your AdWords ad, there's actually an infinitely greater number of elements and options to test on your web page because you can test the fonts and you can test the uh, headlines and you can test the colors and you can test the sizes and you can test the layout and the presence or absence of a particular graphic. And it's, it's just unending. Um, so if you define your elements and options and enter, enter them into the system for your web page, well, the system will then create a profile of web pages for you that you can rotate. And the easy way to rotate that, if you don't have any other type of tracking your conversion installed except for AdWords, then what you do is just create identical copies of your winning ad in AdWords. Whatever ad is winning for you, just create identical copies. However many copies as you need to drive to individual pages for your Taguchi test. So if you define your elements and options and you go over to Ad Comparator and you get, you know, eight different pages, it tells you you've got to create eight different pages and it gives you the profiles for those eight pages. Well, then you create eight different advertising, eight, eight different AdWords ads and you, and they're all identical except they go to different destination URL. So they look ex exactly identical to the browser but the destination URLs are different and the destination URLs for each one of them match the Taguchi pages that Ed Comparator told you to make. Now, as long as you've set up your conversion tracking correctly, which means that when people place an order or they opt in or they do whatever action you want them to, that Google's conversion tracking code gets back to the campaign that, you, um, that you're using to rotate them, then all you need to do is read the conversions on those ads um, in order to figure out what results to put into, into Ad Comparator. Don't get confused. Don't put the click-through in there because the click-through is irrelevant. As a matter of fact, if your click-through is different and you're running identical ads, what that means is that you have not let those ads run long enough and you haven't reached the um, period of stability in your market. Every market has a different period of traffic stability. Some markets become stable after a week. Some markets become stable after a month. Um, some markets take even longer and there, there's a few markets that'll be stable in a day. So, um, so if, if the click through in those ads is wildly different, then you need to wait until they're the same, even if you've got enough conversions on the back end. Uh, but that's a little bonus. Don't worry about it. If you don't understand it, it's, it's really kind of advanced. And, um, I hope this is helpful to you and I hope you actually go do it. Thanks.